Now to the death of Rodney King, the man beaten at the hands of police two decades ago, sparking huge riots in Los Angeles and triggering a national conversation about race. ABC's Cecilia Vega has a look at the life of the man whose simple words had a big impact. Can we all get along? This morning, investigators await toxicology tests to confirm exactly what happened to Rodney King. The man who became the face of police brutality in this country was found dead Sunday at the bottom of his Southern California swimming pool. And he was just getting his life really together. Police say it was likely an accidental drowning. King's girlfriend reportedly told friends he'd been drinking heavily and using marijuana the day before he died. There was no obvious signs of any foul play. This video of four Los Angeles police officers pounding on King was one of the first ever to go viral. Not guilty of the crime of assault by force by And when those officers were acquitted by a jury with no African Americans, it sparked fury on the streets of L.A. I felt like Armageddon or the end of the world, you know, and I was like hurt. I was, I was past upset. More than 50 people were killed in the riots, 2,000 injured, more than $1 billion in damage. And who can forget that now famous plea from the man at the center of it all? Can we, can we all get along? Can we, can we get along? Um, can we stop making it, making it horrible for, for the, for the older people in the, and the, and, the, and the kids. 20 years later, King said he still suffered from nightmares and flashbacks. He spoke to KABC in Los Angeles in April. I have no regrets. I've, I've made some some childish moves and stuff in life, but I've learned from all my, all my mistakes. In a recent interview with National Public Radio, King said he knew exactly what he would want engraved on his headstone. The words, can we all just get along? Can we all get along in peace? For Good Morning America, Cecilia Vega, ABC News, Los Angeles. Remember after the rides, everybody was looking to him, and when he said, can we all get along, the way he handled it really helped defuse a it situation. It helped heal real trauma, mm -hmm. that's true.